One News. Don't worry, guys. Uh, the, the guest is just cleaning my suit jacket. What do I got on me? Something I've got. All right. Hey, welcome back, guys. We're outside. <laughs> Don't mind us. We're talking about the Greek Festival, which is awesome every summer in Colorado. And uh, we've got it going on this weekend. It's a great weekend for it if you're looking for something to do with Dad. Marshall is here from the Greek Festival. The Greek Festival dancers are here as well. Marshall, what should people know fundamentally about the Greek Festival if they've never been? It's a chance for you to try all the homemade foods of Greece, the culture of Greece, and enjoy uh, shopping as if you were living in Greece. It's a lot of fun, and you don't have to be Greek to go, certainly. No, exactly. Look at me. <laughs> so what do you got here? We're going to get back to the dancers in a second. We we're doing some delicious awesome foods job. here. Most of the food we have on grounds are all homemade. Um, we do some beautiful pasticho, which is like a Greek lasagna. We have our spanakopita. This year we use a nice fresh spinach, nice. local spinach. We have our tiropi, the cheese pies here, and then our handmade omadas, stuffed grape leaves. Grape leaves. Exactly. What's inside the grape leaves? So you have rice in there with a meat mixture. Got it. And we do have vegetarian also. Nice. And of course, uh, the crowning tzatziki in the middle. Yeah. Everything has tzatziki sauce, right? Exactly. And what's this here? This is called saganaki. Um, what we do is it's fried cheese, and then they put lemon juice on top of it. Oh, nice. Delicious. Very, Very cool. Delicious. All right, jewelry. I, I know you guys have a lot of uh, vendors out there as well selling lots of cool Greek art and Greek jewelry. Exactly. All of our vendors uh, bring Greek, authentic Greek uh, jewelry. Uh, you can get anything from T-shirts to little... Uh, Bubinettas, different yeah. things that they have, yes. Is this Greek beer? This is Greek beer, Mythos. Yes, it is. I've never seen this before, and it has a cool little tab on that. Look at that, guys. i got to show you. That that makes it popping the top pretty easy. Absolutely, absolutely. Can I open one of these? Please do. Because you're going to do a shot of Uzo. We're going to do a shot of Uzo with what? you. What? <laughs> we do don't don't wrap me into this. Here. we got Greek coffee. There. We also serve the frappe, which is the... Uh, iced coffee. Okay. Very popular in Greece during the summers. Uh, well, if you want to pick up well, our recipe book, that'll tell you all about um, how to make most of these great items. Very cool. Get your ouzo going because we got to wrap up That's here. It. We got lots of food here, guys. You see a Greek salad. Sure. You see uh, our the new pastries. items are called the Euro Bowl, and we also have the Lukaniko, the sausage with the tzatziki. We use a fresh local lettuce to put all these things together. Yeah. And the dancers, what should we know about them? The dancers are wearing authentic uh, costumes. Each costume is from the different areas from where the uh, islands and so forth. <laughs> there we go. All right, so we're going to send it back in you guys. And I think we have to say, read opa, the, read opa, the right? Opa, opa, look at that. Opa, the Greek festival this weekend where? Yes, Friday, Saturday, Sunday at Big Gold Dome, 4610 East Alameda, Colorado, Leeds down Alameda Corners right, All right there. I got a mini tiny little shot of... Uh, of the uh, liqueur. Oh, Come on, jerk. All right, back at you guys. Come on. You got to do more than Ooh, one. It's like black licorice. Yeah, I, I, it I it just does. Did it. it was off camera. It does. <laughs> mm -hmm, sure, you did. 70 degrees.